welcome back to the Sunday Morning Fishing Show. Today's episode, we're going for some sockeye salmon. Now we're actually, guys, we're going to be doing some float fishing for these things today. If you guys don't know what float fishing is, go ahead and look that up. It's a special kind of rod and reel. It doesn't have much of a drag or a drag at all. And you pretty much always have to go near the rapids and just kind of lob your line right inside. Let the current do the job for you. Now as the current brings down my bait, holy shit, we got a fish on already. Now I'm using a mayfly. You can use sacks of row or any type of light weight, lightweight bait. Sorry, I can't even freaking speak today. Holy shit, look at that. Four pounds, two ounces. That's not bad. Oh man. Alright, anyways. So all we gotta do, let me get off this rock here. Just do a little lob in the water here. Let that current pick that bait around. I just give the old real little jerk every once in a while just to kind of keep it moving, making sure there's no slack line out there, and bam, we got a fish on already. Now these sockeye salmon, they're coming in the river to spawn right now, so they're all over the place. Now if you had hip waders on, you could you'd be they'd be bouncing off your feet when you're sitting in the water there. They don't even care about you at all. They're here to spawn. They're just hitting out of aggression. They don't actually want the food. I'm just pissing them off by putting it in front of them all the time and they're territorial, so well, that makes me uh, a good fisherman. I tell you what. Oh man, we got another one. Holy now that's what I'm talking about guys, a nice short reel. I'm real close to shore here. All you gotta do is lob the old line in the rapids and man oh man they're coming in like crazy. Holy! It is an absolute beautiful day out here. A gorgeous day for fishing. Like lob that line, I'm just gonna let that sit right so. Maybe we get a few fish in, who knows, man. I'm just going to let that chill. But look at how beautiful it is today. We got no clouds in the sky. Holy shit, look at that. We got some salmon blasting upstream for us. Oh, we got them, man. See, the stream kind of helps us out because they get tired real fast trying to swim upstream when you get hooked. Holy shit, look at all those fish out there, man. Holy Look at all those sockeye salmon. I'm pretty sure I've said this fact about them before. But they're actually blue, man. When they're out at sea, they come on in and they turn red when they're ready to spawn. Just like they're ready to do right now. That's why there's so many of them. And they're all over the place. They're swimming from downstream, upstream, middle stream. Holy shit, we got sockeye salmon everywhere. Holy. I'm getting excited, man. They're great eating. You can get their eggs and use it for row, even though I don't suggest that. Because you got to put the eggs back in the water, let them do their thing. So if you're going to keep them, make sure you keep a male. Let the females out there lay all their eggs that they have, because that's all they got inside of them. Those dudes can squirt more than once, so it's not a big deal if you're keeping the odd male here and there. But like I was saying, let's get back into this fishing. And we got one in right now. Let's see what this bitch is going to weigh. Oh, man. Four pounds, five ounces. That is not too bad. That's a beautiful fish right there. Now, I actually had a request from my last episode to show you guys where I am. I'm fishing off the Coda River. It's an absolutely gorgeous river. I love fishing off of it. There's tons of different types of fish here. We got sockeye salmon. I know a little bit of a pike hole, and I love my pike fishing. That's one of my favorite. We got a little perch. We got some bass, largemouth, smallmouth. Man, this is a really cool river. We got all different types of fish in it. Just depends on where you are on the river, and you're going to get a little bit of something different every time. I'm actually filled up with these things. Hey, I've been hit my limit. I probably shouldn't even be fishing. If the game warden found me, I'd be in big trouble right now. But that's okay. I don't think he's going to come around. I'm not going to keep any more. We're just going to do a little bit fishing. But holy shit, did you just see all those fish out there? There's no way I can go home. Yeah, there's fish to be caught, man. Holy. 
Anywho, guys, I'm going to ramble on here all damn day. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. You guys are awesome for supporting this thing. I think this is episode 17, man. Holy. Now, that's impressive. I would never think that I would make 17 episodes of a fishing show on my game, man. Now, this is unreal. Thank you, God. Holy shit. We got a dead fish right here. There's fish everywhere, man. Holy. That's how that's how many fish there is. They're just coming up on shore on their own, too. Holy moly. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Please share, like, and subscribe, and I will catch you on the next one.